had to save his life over and over and over. Tonight, a distraught mother worried sick about her son who's in the hospital right now after getting hit by a truck while riding his bike. Thanks for joining us at six. I'm Andrew Kinsey and I'm Yolanda Harris. This happened in London at the intersection of South Main Street and Center Street more than a week ago. His mother says she is still waiting for answers from police about what happened. New at six tonight, 10 TV's Lindsay Mills took her concerns straight to the police chief. This is the intersection here in London where a 16 year old boy was hit by a vehicle while riding his bike more than a week ago. Now his mother is demanding answers from police. This isn't a like little tiny thing. This is something where they're saying like best case scenario, we might leave the hospital in a year. They're talking intensive and critical care for that long. And you're telling me that you couldn't tell it seemed that she was speeding on Monday, May 9th, around 930 PM. Her son Landon Minor was hit at the intersection of South Main and Center Streets in London. London police say an investigation remains underway and today released surveillance video of the crash from a gas station at the intersection. In the first video, you can see a person on a bike riding towards the intersection. A truck traveling through the intersection strikes the bike. In another view, you can see the rider approaching the intersection on the bike. The light changes from green to yellow as the driver passes through. The vehicle stops and then reverses and you can see one person get out of the vehicle. Leslie Townsend says she wants the driver to face charges and she has concerns about the investigation. She wants to know if the driver was given a sobriety test. I have to fight for my son because people need to know the law because the police didn't do their job at all. So far, London police have not filed any charges. The Madison County prosecutor says he has not received a referral for the case from police and won't until police wrap up their investigation. He adds it's not unusual for an investigation like this to take a week or longer. Today, a release on the London police app says London police are awaiting information from various sources to finalize the investigation. Here in London, there is a candlelight vigil planned for tonight for Landon. It starts at 8 o'clock. In London, Lindsay Mills, 10TV News.